Hi, my name is Chanel Beckley. Um, I'm a senior in the College of Arts and Sciences. I'm double majoring in African Studies and Anthropology. Um, I'm a proud member of Onyx Senior Honor Society and the outgoing retired chair of the African American Arts Alliance. And this is my note to self. Note to self. Freshman year, you do not need to be at all of those parties. I promise it's gonna be the same thing the week after that and the week after that with the same people, with the same music and the same drinks and the same crazy jungle juice. You'll be fine. You don't need to do that. You don't need to be at all of them. Um, your friendship groups are going to change and that's okay. That's perfectly fine. Um, people grow, people learn more about themselves and people are able to support one another in different ways and that's fine. Um, also, you live really close to Penn, so you, but, but you don't need to go home as often as you did, like, it's okay, New York is right there, New York will still be there, relax. Um, I think, I also need you to calm down with your extracurriculars, right, I need you to relax because I know that you might be excited and you want to do a dabble in a bit of everything, but it's really important to find your niche and to find what you're passionate about. Um, you're going to love Comedies Elementary School and you're going to absolutely adore members of the African American Arts Alliance. So just stick to that, just do that um, and make those your primary things. It's way better to be great at something than to be mediocre at a whole bunch of things. So do that. Um, you're gonna love your experience as a producer. You might do it twice. Um, you're gonna love your experiences in the Maku Black Cultural Center. They are going to be the reason you graduate. I, they're going to be the reason you graduate. Like, let me say that again. They're going to be the reason you graduate because there are just so many resources that they have and there are just so many things about this campus that are really hard to navigate as a woman of color and you're gonna appreciate the support that you can get here. Dana Troy is gonna become your best friend. You're gonna text her all hours of the night when you need stuff. Dr. Peterson is going to be your confidant and someone who can help you through some really hard times. And he's also just going to be your professor. And he's also going to be somebody that introduces you to a whole other group of people that you need to know. You need to know Dr. Currington, you need to know Rev Gibson, Dr. Beavers, the list goes on. But you'll need to meet all these people, make sure you know who they are, make sure they know who you are, and make sure that you understand that there's a community of trust around you. Um, and also, reach back. As you progress through your pen career, I'm gonna need you to do the same that upperclassmen did for you for those coming after you. Um, just from things, from something as small as inviting someone over for a cup of tea, or just cooking a meal and inviting friends, inviting underclassmen, allowing opportunities for them to share their woes because they will be going through a lot of the things that you went through and that you found your way through. Um, your faith in God is going to become strengthened and that's gonna mean a lot to you. That's gonna be very important for your personal growth and for you just getting through the craziness that is this campus. And should the racial climate of this campus, should it get a little crazy, know that you have an amazing group of young Black Panthers <laughs> on this campus ready to ride. <laughs> so, so think about that as you progress through um, and as you, as you formulate your responses to certain things that happen on campus. Um, don't stay quiet. That's not going to help anything and that's not an option. Um, your passion and education will be strengthened through that and you will fight for educational equity and you will love it. And you will love the people who help you get there. That is my note to self. <laughs>